What's up, guys? How's it going? Hey, I, uh, I, I guess I don't, I don't know how many of you can tell, but I'm not a particularly manly guy. I'm not a, a manly dude. Um, I guess that may be made fairly obvious by the fact that I look like a backup dancer for B2K. I'm not, I'm not a manly guy. I, uh, I cannot grow a beard. That's the honest to God truth. This is the best beard I've ever grown in my life. This is it. I, uh, I don't, every time I try to grow a beard, it comes in really patchy and spotted. My beard makes me look like Swiss cheese with a black man hiding inside. It's your black tail out of that cheese. You are lowering the property value of my cheese. I'm not a manly, I don't, I, I'm not a big drinker. I don't, like my favorite drink is not a tall beer. Or I don't even really know another manly drink to be perfectly honest. Uh, Jack and egg yolk, I really have no idea. I'm actually, I'm actually a big fan of Snapple. That's my favorite drink. Don't judge me, fella. Uh, I do, I love Snapple. My favorite part about Snapple, everybody's favorite part, the little facts underneath the cap. You learned so much. Like the other day, I learned, thanks to Snapple, that flamingos are pink because they eat shrimp, and their skin actually takes on the color of the food that they eat. That's true. I also learned that white people are white because you eat the hopes and dreams of everyone around you. <laughs> It's the same effect. <laughs> it's a little strange to find underneath your Snapple cap. <laughs> this Snapple is racist <laughs> and really honest. My favorite Snapple fact, I'll share this with you. My favorite Snapple fact was when I learned that oysters actually have the, uh, the ability to change their sex from male to female as frequently as they may choose. I also learned that my Uncle Stacy might be part oyster. <laughs> but mostly really gay. He is. <laughs> He's terribly gay. <laughs> you guys have been fun. My name's Lane.